Hey quad bros, welcome back to another video here guys. I've had so many people asking me how do backpacks work, what are backpacks, what do they do, and so on and so forth. So I figured I'd do a quick video here telling you guys all about backpacks and how to use them. But first, I just wanted to give a quick shout out and quick thank you to all of you guys who have subbed and followed over on twitch.tv slash heyquadro, my Twitch channel, and you know commented and liked the videos and everything like that, and, and, all, and all the kind words, because we just hit a thousand subs and it has blown me away. I'm like in shock because I totally didn't expect this to happen. So again, guys, thank you so, so much. And if you guys haven't subbed and you like the videos, please consider hitting that sub button, hit the like button, comment down below any videos that you guys wanna see in the future. But without further ado, guys, let's jump into talking about backpacks. First thing everyone should know is that not all soldiers can equip backpacks. So you can see here, the flame trooper has to have the flamethrower gas bag and you cannot change this out. You cannot unequip that. And the radio operator has the radio devices and you can actually unequip this, but there's no reason to because you cannot equip backpacks on your radio operators. So your other soldiers, however, can equip backpacks, but not until they get the upgrades. So you have to come to the personnel upgrades here and work your way down the tree to finally get this backpack slot upgrade. And you do have to choose between being able to bring a backpack or bringing a secondary weapon. So once you guys have gotten all of that done and you're ready to equip backpacks, you have to get the backpacks through the logistics. So you're gonna come here to the equipment delivery and here you can see backpack, grenade pouch and ammo pouch. These are all backpacks, despite the name, the only one of them is actually named backpack, but they all do different things. There's also large variants of them down here for four bronze orders, as opposed to the small variants that just cost one. So what do the backpacks actually do? So if we come over here, we can see here that normal backpacks give you one additional inventory space and large backpacks give you three additional inventory space grenade pouches are similar they give you one extra grenade space and large give you two additional ammo pouches are in my opinion the best of the backpacks they give you 10 percent extra ammo or plus one at minimum extra magazines so for the small ammo pouches they're probably going to give you plus one magazines these are really really good on your gunner squads or maybe your smg squads to be able to bring more ammo and the large ammo pouches are incredible they give you an extra 100 percent ammo it is fan Fantastic. These are a blessing from on high. Grab these guys, use them for your gunners, give your gunners extra ammo. So what, what would you actually use these in practice for, guys? So we can go look at my aptly named Roderick Rogers, the grandfather of Aaron Rogers here. It is, you know, here he's got 75% faster med pack usage and better med pack healing, which is fantastic. This is a very good combo. And so, hey, I gave him a backpack. I gave him a large backpack, and now he's got a bunch of med kits. He can heal himself up. He can heal my uh, my other squad members up. He can heal me up. He can revive me if I've gone down, things like that. Really, really cool, really, really powerful. We can also go, I believe, up here to this man, one of these guys, whoever, one of my soldiers has, yeah, 50% longer throwing range of grenades. So, hey, we can give him, uh, I don't have it equipped, but I could give him a grenade pouch and be able to equip extra grenades or alternatively on you know, Gary Garcia here, I've given him a large grenade pouch for some smoke grenades for my assault squad. So I'll switch to Gary Garcia, throw a bunch of smoke grenades forward, and then I'll be able to move up with my assault team. So that's just kind of some practical examples that you can do with them. Or my Browning squads here, I've given some ammo pouches because they're going to be firing a lot. The Browning chews through ammo. So I wanted to give them some extra ammo pouches for that. One other thing that you can do is you can also give backpacks to some of your uh, crewmen. So then they can carry some extra toolboxes or even bring some med kits if you wanted to. I don't really recommend bringing med kits for your tank squads, but hey, you know, maybe you want to. And finally, you could also give, you know, a backpack maybe to an engineer or something like that and have them carry, you know, some toolboxes to repair some friendly tanks. You know, maybe you're queued up with someone like that and you're you're like, hey man, you don't need to get out of your tank. I'll repair your tank for you. I've got a guy with some toolboxes and you can help him out like that. Bombers also benefit from ammo pouches for their you know, anti-tank weapons to bring more ammo. But guys, that is it. That's how backpacks work. Pretty, pretty cut and dry, pretty simple. Basically give ammo pouches to your gunners, give med kits to your medics of your squads and things like that. Give your uh, grenade pouches to your grenadiers and, you know, use them pretty effectively. You guys that can throw grenades farther. If you guys enjoyed the video, please you guys remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know some more things in Enlisted that you guys want to explain, some things that don't quite make sense 
And also let me know if you guys just want to see some normal gameplay videos. You know, I'm considering just posting some stream highlights, things like that. And also remember to send your top clips, your enlisted clips that you found funny or badass or amazing. We've already gotten a couple ones that are awesome. Send that to the email down below in the, in the description and I will splice those together into a quadro clips of the week. And that'll be a lot of fun going forward. Without anything else, guys, I hope you guys have a great day, great night, wherever you're at, and I'll see you next time.